save for the ninety and nine in the fold. Save from the night and the storms and the cold. But oh, said the shepherd, while counting the fold, one sheep is missing. Oh, there must be one more. Oh, the shepherd went out to search for his sheep. And all through the night on the rocky steeps, and he searched till he found him. And in love there he bound. Him, oh, I was that one low sheep. It was the day of my life. I was a rock musician playing with a group that had a number one hit across the nation. Today, I'm telling others about Christ, how they can be set free from sin. And as we travel to one of our places, we pass a little town, and this little town is called Luica. And uh, every time I go through there, my heart would get warm. We went down to the last street of the village. It's got 10 houses on one street, no electricity, uh, no water. And we start preaching and singing. And then all of a sudden we hear a man screaming at the top of his voice, three houses down, shaking his fist and telling us to shut up and get out of there. And we have no right to be there. He's going to come up there and drag us in the road and beat us up. Și a zis Jegu și Dănui că ne mâncați pe fumiștii și de atunci eu chiar m-am activat rugat. This man was a drunkard that beat his wife and beat his child. I preached about Mary Magdalene, how the Lord Jesus loved this woman. And finally just sit there and all of a sudden I looked, his wife was standing beside him and his daughter was kind of a sad tilt too, so they weren't looking in each other's face. But all three at the same time started weeping it was shooting out and coming down and hitting their face all three of them at the same time and he started crying and just tears started running down his face he said i almost lost my wife twice m-am dus la ulterița la spital la noi aici așa când am ajuns să mă iertați a pornit hemoragia din mine vroia ca să îl dau afară că deci era un copil mort în mine zic gata ce o să fie o să fie ce o să întâmple cu mine zic numai Dumnezeu poate să mă salveze zic pupa aia și talpa lui când a venit soțul după mine, m-a întrebat, pe cine vrei să vezi? Zic, vreau să-mi văd soțul. Și am cerut de la însărutat, cade, ducă, ce să mai discutăm? Eu gândeam că gata, zic, moare. Și Dumnezeu, pupa aia și talpa lui, a făcut uh, chestia asta, deci de mare întors, dintre morți. He said, God is so good to give me my wife. Mi-a înviat. And I'm thinking, well, here God has touched this man's heart. So I know he's ready to hear the gospel. No, he's not a Christian, but he had enough awareness to know that God had to intervene to save his wife. She was dying. Now, finally, his little daughter told me yesterday, she said, my daddy doesn't get drunk and beat me anymore. And I said, what? She said, no, he's happy. Mama's happy and I'm happy. That's the difference when we go in these little villages. The gospel brings light. And he was at like the Bulabasha, that's what they call him here, the king of the gypsies on that street. He run the whole show. Dacă ei mă vede pe mine cam să mă păcăiesc și eu le spun și le spui adevărul de Dumnezeu, s-ar păcăi și ei. Am o fetiță de 16 ani și un băiețel de 6 ani. Am fost de acord și l-am lăsat că el a ținut tot timpul și a plăcut să cânte, să roage, pentru că zic este o cale spre bine. And now that same mean man, we have a church at his house. And uh, the house is, the, the roof has holes in it, uh, some of the paneling is off, it's, so broken up as asbestos. It caused cancer, everybody knows that. He tried to cover it up, but he doesn't have any money, these people. Trăim și noi, da, pe mâine, muncim cu ziua ca să putem să trăim. Lasă apă la cazma, punem ustroi, punem ceapă, la spar la lemne. Dă lunii acolo, dacă vine o zăpadă, ce facem? There's no gabling, so the wind goes up and goes over, and the snow and everything comes in. Zăpadă intră, intră în pod, iarna o dau jos. Dă trei ori, trebuie să mă rog în pod, că altfel ține rocoare, ține frig. Cade pe noi, tavat. And he said, Brother Martin, if you'll fix this room up, you can have it for a Sunday school or you can have it for the church building, but we have to put uh, a new roof on it 
And all together, to fix that house, I think we thought about it yesterday, it cost about $650, $700. Well, you see the leaves falling, it's getting cold. I mean, yesterday we were out there, and you'll see these children, that, these children, honest, my heart was broken when I seen some of them, no shoes on. Now it's right in the middle of November, we're at November the 18th. It can be put on in two days. If I, had to, if I had the funds in my hand right now, I can put that roof on in two days. By the middle of next week, that roof will be on his house. A new roof, red roof. It's hard to sleep at night when you think and roll up and you cover, and you think about that wind coming over that thing. It, it's almost impossible, and the roof leaking. And we want to stop that. All to Lord Jesus I surrender. All to Him I freely give. I will ever love and trust Him in His presence daily. Oh, the joy of full surrender. 